Good morning, it's Jean. I wanted to come out here and film the rest of my fairy gardens uh, like I promised you before the rain hits because I need to place them where they're going because right now I've just got them all on the back deck and please excuse the deck. We have not cleaned our furniture or anything uh, because of the pollen and now with the rain coming so hopefully this week we'll be able to clean our side and then do everything we need to do. This is the succulent fairy garden that I just finished and I just love the way it looks. Look at the little fairy. She's on a stake and, but it looks like she's sitting on that succulent that looks like a tree. And of course the little fairy house came from Michael's. The tub came from Walmart and John took treated wood and made feet because around here if you set any flower pot down flat on any surface ants get in it so uh, that was the easiest thing we could do on these odd shaped things was to for him just to make little feet. We screwed them on the bottom. I love these little succulents so I think they're just wonderful. And I have some oregano, and there's a succulent in that one. And I cannot remember the name of this plant. Let me see. See how pretty it is? It's called Limerick Isabella Trifolum. It reminds me of a shamrock, except it has the various colors. And there's the little fairy just peeking around. And this is a small one. I just have the evergreen and the creeping oregano and the little sedum and the little baby fairies in a flower under the tree taking a nap. And this is the one that you saw in the challenge. It's actually growing. Look how the time is hanging over. I love that one. And this has the Irish moss and the polka dot plant and thyme. And back there is that variegated uh, geranium and it's just doing wonderful. And there again, this one has evergreens and little signs and a little fairy and the little pink polka dot plant and the thyme. And this one has the two colors of the iris moss and the little evergreen and the little rocks and so forth. I've got stuff to make a patriotic one, but I haven't found just the right plants to do that one. Then it's one more. This has a uh, jade plant, and I'm not sure how the proper way to pronounce it, Cal calanchoe or calancho, I've heard it pronounced both ways, and it has thyme and the iris moss and the little bunny and the little sign that says, welcome, my friends. And right there is a baby Japanese maple that a friend brought John. Well, that's all the fairy gardens for right now, but I'm sure more will join this collection. I hope you're having a great day. Till the next time.